and I hear that we are just about ready for the blasphemous All Bosses Glitch Run, so I'm gonna send it over to the couch. Take it away. We're the right. couch. We're the Hi, couch. They're, they're the couch. That's us. That's, uh, that's Shasta, that's uh, Denny. I'm Teddy, hi. hi I think Teddy. we had a, hi Kurt. Uh, I think we had a donation incentive uh, for skin color, right? I believe we went with the Shadow the Hedgehog skin, right? <laughs> oh. Is that right, or we need somebody to like vote default? We have got true apostasy. Has oh won. yeah, that's what it's called. <laughs> all right. That fake Let apostle get... again, of all places. I found right. you, faker. <laughs> <laughs> this is the ultimate. Ready? Three, two, one, go. All right, right away I skipped an unskippable cutscene, so we're ready on that speedrunner BS. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There's a close a bunch of like corpse butts and stuff, so you're welcome, GDQ staff. We don't get to see that. You're gonna have to censor every one of those on YouTube. <laughs> yeah. You can't see them, they're too far away. Yeah. It's all shoulders anyway, you can't even tell the difference. Look, oh yeah, I did a light shield there. We just got HP for free pretty much. No time wasted. Hang on, let me disable tutorial messages, but it's gonna make me wait anyway. Like, imagine there's a tutorial here. What am I imagining it says? Press A. It's like, uh, use the shrine pretty much. Oh. And here's our first boss. He's angry. Rawr. Dang, calm down, dude. Or relax, buddy. It's okay. He's angry about Gotta hit him with the slap chops, though. He's angry about all the butts. Jeez, don't jump, mate. What are you doing? You're getting hecked. Yeah, I'm hitting the duck button to cancel my head so I go faster. Excellent. Take that. He did. Victory. Easy peasy. The first game compared to Dark Souls in the past, is that kind of like the first boss of Dark Souls where you're supposed to come back later and defeat them, or...? Uh, you'll see. Okay. All right, this cutscene is really weird. We gotta skip it, though. Fair enough. Most of the cutscenes are really weird. There's a lot of great WTF material in this game, but, like, can't watch it no time. <laughs> like, he, like, fills his head with that guy's uh, Kool-Aid or whatever he's got inside him, and I'm like, oh, we get an upgrade or something after beating the boss. No, he just does that. I don't understand why. Is that how you get upgrades? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna skip all this plot. Don't worry about it. It's not, and that's only important for 100. percent You just wasted my time. Thank you, buddy. I'm gonna take the heal for safety. Screw it. Why not? Man, Tingle got taller. What? <laughs> <laughs> uh, you'll notice some horses in the background, but also some wagon wheels, and the, the, the okay. wagons. So right. what we figured is, me and my chat, we figured out that they eat the wagons. Like you can't eat the horses. They're good boys. You feed them carrots, pet them, whatever. But the wagons, no, them's good eating. <laughs> By the way, I just skipped a spell. We're not gonna use spells in this run. Spells are dumb. We do have sword. That's the only spell I need. Take that. I, I cast slash. Doesn't run out of mana. Yeah. I'm just gonna do some little platforming. That's pretty much it. All right, we do down air attacks. This is the thing we can do. They, give you, they make you go up a little bit. I'm gonna hit this baby. Yeah. You're free. <laughs> it's the only baby we free, I think, because it's the only one that's useful to us. And here we have uh, some lore coming up. Everyone be quiet. Lore. This legend is ahead to embolch the sequels. And my ornate throne turns its back on those who wait here. Okay, so now we know the plot of the game. So guys, what do you think about it? <laughs> you told me to come in blind. <laughs> First of all, it took forever to find the stage. Second of all, <laughs> It's the Legends of the Hidden Temple sequel we did not need. <laughs> that's definitely Olmec right there. Yeah, that's Olmec. <laughs> it's Olmec. <laughs> Oh, yeah, fun fact, this part of the game takes place in Orlando. We're gonna go through the abandoned Nickelodeon studios here. Oh. Look out, slime! <laughs> ah. Oh no! Slime. <laughs> okay, we're, we're good, no slime. I didn't say the magic words, I didn't say, I don't know. Oh, uh, okay, we're good, didn't get slime there. Watch out for the shambling corpse of Danny Tamborelli. <laughs> <laughs> he was in GTA, he's alive. He's alive. <laughs> Settle down, folks. Yeah, you got any I questions you... right now? That's a good time to ask Yeah, me. I saw you got hit by a spear there, and then again, is that, is that because it's Oh faster? yeah, pretty much. Yeah, I'm giving you he a clear. Spears, whatever. He's had worse. <laughs> She's gonna pass by this guy. Hey, seems like a we... bad beat, but I got places oh. to be. Was that intentional? Yeah, don't worry about it. Okay. I'll explain that later. We got a bigger one coming up. It's like the shortest one. You just did I just miss? Nice. Cross guy's going at me. Hey. So that's some time wasted. Cool, right? Yeah. That's what that area looks like down there. If you fail. <laughs> Thank you for showing that. Content. I appreciate it. Yeah, the failure zone. Hate those cross dudes. Just throwing their cross rings at me. 
We have our first kind of boss. It doesn't really count, but like we're gonna beat her anyway. Every time I do a down air attack on more than one object, it does as much damage as like everything I hit. So if I hit two objects with a down air, I do double damage. If I hit three, I do triple. He's gonna do lightning. Don't hit me. I want her to just like miss me with all these so I can just keep slapping her. Oh, dang, I, I messed those up. I don't want to hit those stats. There's guys there, man. Yeah. Anything that has a hitbox counts. Oh, shoot. This thing has a gigantic hitbox. Oh, I blocked it. Hell yeah, I'm good at this game. <laughs> <laughs> Miss. I hit that guy too, whatever. We're going to knock at the bonus damage. This fight just sucks. It takes forever. Because, you know, I don't have any bonus damage yet. There was a shrine back there I could have gotten for damage, but it's way fa Oh, God, lightning. It's way faster just to skip that. So you're going to do a glitch in a second. Stop it. How? Rude. I'm going to play safe and not die. Oh, never mind. She's dead. Cool. Cool. <laughs> Just one bap in the head. Does your hat get taller with each boss you defeat? I wish. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna have like 30 seconds to pause the game for. So, uh, read donations. Couch, deactivate. Excellent. We've got $75 from Satoru. I've been speedrunning for a long time, almost 15 years. And I'm always blown away with how much the scene has grown and continues to grow. You all are a family to me. Keep watching, keep donating, and take care of yourselves. $100 from Calevra. My buddy Mike got me into GDQ several years ago, and it has been something I look forward to every year since. I love seeing our community come together for some true good. Let's beat cancer. Donation goes to Commentator's Choice. $20 from Desert. Hey, GDQ, long time watcher, long time donator. Always happy to donate to a good cause. Shout out to all the people who participate in this awesome event. Special shout out to my friend Mo, who is surely watching right now. Oops, too far. Okay. More time, come on down. Yeah, there we go. Maybe we just skip the area for a little bit. We have to go back in there later, but it sucks, but whatever. Skeet. So when you grab one of those ledges where I can slash my sword into like that, can we and reactivate then, yet? Oh, yeah, reactivate. Couch reactivate. Sorry, I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you're doing stuff. <laughs> so yeah, anyway, when, when I hit one of those ledges, then I uh, oh. go off one of those and go on a le ledge I can grab and pause right there. I start building up a momentum until I unpause. Here's another glitch. I'm back. I, I fell asleep again. during Subnautica. What happened? <laughs> Did I? No, I didn't get it. All right, hang on. Give me a sec. Did I? I didn't get it. So this is the Metroid of Dark Soulsvanias. No, there's like no Metroid at all. It's all Castlevania. Okay. Alvania, no Troy, and there we go. <laughs> What, what you doing? I'm getting the pause menu to show up so I can do a glitch here. Oh, we have more time for donations. I need the audience to help me count here. Hang on. One. I'm doing 11 times. Donations, go. Come on, Cardi. Got it. $10 <laughs> from Leviathan. He says, good luck, Teddy. Uh, we... Two. <laughs> no, uh, <laughs> 2020 from Onyx of Octavia. Waking up early on my day off, watching one of my favorite games to be run, Donating to a great cause. Now just one thing left to do. Three. Three. Honk. <laughs> We've just got a short time left with this game to get that upgrade to hard mode and the psychotherapy Four. met for Katana Zero. So please get your donations in. Please update it to hard mode in the middle of this glitch. Five. That's uh, uh, uh. what you're doing right now. Uh, I'm buffing my damage. Keep her in donations. Uh, Why are you doing this 11 times, dude? I'm ready. $250 from an anonymous donor. Six. Woo! Looking forward to the Goose Game run. Honk! Thank you, anonymous. Honk! And thank you for all those park benches in my hometown. We've got... Seven. $40 from a hero called Spiro. Hello from Seattle. Hello. My cat's name is Spiro. Hey, am I an eight? Like, I, I'm losing track, honestly. That's okay. eight. $10 from Blue Lancer. I've been watching GDQ for three years, and it never ceases to amaze me how, how amazing right. this community is. Keep up the good work. What happens if we overshoot on this glitch? Uh, we kick more ass. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Ten. Ten. Like, time wasted, but... $500 from Grand Felegion. Nice. And thus... Guilt, repentance, oh, oh, mourning, and every pain of the soul of all kind were visibly and tangibly manifested all everywhere and in all of us. Sometimes in the form of blessing and grace, sometimes in the form of punishment and corruption. That divine will, equally pious and cruel, which we could not and will never be able to unravel, was called the run. 
Yeah, we're good. I messed up at the end there, but it's fine. I, it wasn't the last one, doesn't matter at all. Okay, literally what happened? Uh, I just got really buff. Sick. I think the most you can get, you, you're obviously supposed to get one damage level from each thing, but like, I just got 11 there. The most you can get is like seven and around their seven shrines. So we're now stronger than the game would normally allow us yeah, to Yeah, we're be. huge. Okay, I gotta destroy these swole statues real quick. <laughs> Not a swole this, this is, <laughs> <laughs> God, I'm getting, you get hit on the ladder, you fall off. Yeah, Hondo's, a, this area's called Hondo. It's a giant upside down bell. Unfortunately, I can't like clip through the bottom, so I gotta go around and break these statues. They're holding the clapper. There's no clapper clip. Can't clip the clapper. <laughs> I could clip the clapper, I, or if a, clip, a clapper clip existed, I'd clap, but I can't clip the clapper, so I gotta clap the clapper, you know what I mean? Yes. <laughs> you feel me? That's, uh, I that, feel you, that, that made about you. as much sense as anything else, but yes. Yeah, oh, wow, I'm actually almost dead, too. I'm gonna take a shrine in a second, so no biggie. You need to do it for teleporting. Yeah, that'd be cool. Shasta, is a thing inside of a bell called a clapper? I'm pretty sure, I don't I think know. think so, yeah. Yeah, I've just called it a ding-dong dangle. It's <laughs> <laughs> another word for it. Yeah, that's what I call it, too. Yeah. The dinginator. Oh, God, don't hit me. But enough about my nicknames. <laughs> <laughs> but also, those walls, too, if you get hit off them, you get hit while I'm on, you just fall off. It sucks. Oh, it doesn't... We're gonna get this old man's toe. It's gonna uh, make me go fast. Oh. His fourth toe specifically. There we go. Made of life. I don't know if I explained this, but yeah, uh, I think it's the first thing we can actually see. Every time I do a quit out, you go to the last bonfire rested, so we just skipped a bunch of stuff. Hey, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna see if I can make this cycle or not. Probably not. It's dumb. Eh. All right, spikes are instant. I missed it. Whatever. Spikes are instant kills, so I'm really careful around them. Like, instantly. Just you touch them, you die. Well, that's not good. So yeah. this is a Sonic Vania. <laughs> Yeah, right, but that's what the toad did. It lets me just constantly slide, and there's no cooldown anymore. So if we get speed. If he'd given you all of his toes made of granite, then you could walk on the spikes. I wish. I think he's being very selfish. Dev's he need to have more toes. Yeah, Dev's, where you at? We're like nine toes short of a combo here. Let's go. I think there's like DLC coming out for this game or something. Whoops. There we go. Hope they had more toes than that DLC. <laughs> Give me more toes. <laughs> oh, come on. He's going to heck me or no, we're good. I need to do a launch here. Wee. Okay. Yeah, oh, okay. a small statue. Eat a carb, why don't you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, imagine being this full in January. Come on. Where's your holiday wave? So the thick months. Come on. We're on vacation right now. Come on. <laughs> yeah, we're going to dong the bell now. Bong. So I'm going to figure out how to clip through here. Like, there's a bunch of ways to clip in this in these old patches, but uh, none of them are useful. <laughs> I oh. found so many dumb clips that none of them had done anything for me. Safety bonfire might as well. Oh yeah, so I gotta point out, this is an old patch of the game. But the devs have done something amazing. They patched out, like, basically every bug I knew about in this game, which I don't ever think I've seen. Were they on your Twitter? No, like, they patched the speedrun glitches out first, and I was really salty about, but, like, they got every other glitch after that. It's like, dang, dude, nice. Yeah, this is one of them. Like, you can't hurt these guys right away. That's not intentional. They fixed in the patch. Don't go blow the map, please. Thank you. <laughs> they were to go through two boss arenas here. Or not boss arenas, uh, enemy arenas. You grab the ledge, what are you doing? He's very grabby, this guy. Mm -hmm. Heck. Ah. Should probably heal when I get in here, right? Yeah. Like, oh, no, I did too late when I We got a parry. Bam. You can, like, hit their hitbox here. It doesn't do anything, though. <laughs> Just a fun little thing. I got unlucky. If I'm lucky, I can hit both at once, but it's based on where they spawn in, so. Bam. See you later. Cast sword at maximum level. It's easy. Oh, wait. Oh, don't go down here. That's not where you want to go. No That's detours. Gonna... Oh. Okay. Uh, there's, a, there's a third one, but this is an arena. It's just a debate. Maybe there's like a third enemy type, but like someone's like, nah. Let's just move on and make more game. Then we got the first real boss coming up right here. This lady can help me. We're going to ignore her. So actually, the good thing is if you get her help a bunch of times, she just dies from it. Like, next time you see her, she's got, like, gray hair and everything. It's like, eesh. Don't need your help that badly. I'm gonna do down air attacks on as much of these as I can. If I hit, like, all three at once, I do triple damage, so that's what I want. Yeah, and it's triple damage to each one of the ones, right? Yeah. they all do the share of health. Yeah, they're all, they're all the same. They're also forming up Voltron here. So, oh, we got them cool before they can do it. That's uh, what it looks like. We did it. Cool Voltron made out of potatoes. <laughs> made out of... 
three Angustias. Requiem Eternam. <laughs> yeah, we did it. Our reward is we're going to go to the Cowabunga Zone. <laughs> you see what I mean? Needs. Gonna sit in front of old man long arms here. You know, that's just his family name. It's a coincidence that his arms are long. Surf's up, dudes. <laughs> There's some guys posing up there. And then we're gonna talk to this uh, big head that we caught eating nacho chips earlier. <laughs> he wasn't ready for company yet. Rangers. Rita Repulsa is attacking the surf. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, our friend from the beginning that gave us a plot dump, now we don't talk to you. Hey, Tinkle. <laughs> Tinkle, oh god. Yeah, he, Why that, did I not notice that before? <laughs> yeah, that's his name now, enjoy that. It's for now the rest Tinkle of your forever, life. what the heck? Hey, I wish I could show this cutscene, it's the weirdest one, but I have to skip it. Because speed, get out of here. Ain't got time to see that. No time for enjoyments. Yeah, I got more <laughs> health now. Those are the legs I saw 11 times earlier. Oh, wait, no, that was a different. Oh, yeah, it starts playing the other cutscene here, too. Yeah. Yeah, there's a different cutscene there. I don't, they overlap for some reason, I don't know why. Just like a frame of that. But yeah, now's a good time you guys get more questions because we're going to be walking for like five minutes. It's like the longest stretch. Why are you walking for five minutes? Because it's really far away. Oh, okay. Why don't you run? Wouldn't that be faster? I'm sliding. Sliding's I'd, faster. I'll just take a car or something. Streamer, have I you wish played Hollow Knight? No, I wish. <laughs> I need to. Same. <laughs> are we there yet? <laughs> uh, nah. Gotta slide a couple more minutes. By the way, these guys kiss boo-boos. That's their whole lore reason for existing. <laughs> Literally, they're like, they're back there kissing. Just make it better. These are boo-boo kissers without borders. Yeah. We are the kissers of wounds, or something like that is what he says. There's another baby. Bye, baby. No, that's, that's a corpse. Baby. What are you doing? There was a baby up there. Where's the baby? Oh, it's that baby, the cage baby, yeah. 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 Those weird angel things. <laughs> she angry. <laughs> Those three dudes together in the ground? Yeah, one of them's useless. He's just there for moral support. It's the other two are like cursed, rock hander. It's a cursed Doug Trio evolution. <laughs> it is. <laughs> it's a Galarian Doug Trio. Oh, God. Oh, we jumped over the spikes. That's the only part I'm going to die on really much. Yeah, the Eternium Doug Trio. Went from having fabulous hair to being dead. <laughs> oh, yeah, they had like the Hanson hair. Yeah, it's so cool. <laughs> All right, there's an infinite pit there. That's the other place I could die here. Hanson hair? You did it. Are you? What? <laughs> I don't know. Making boomer references over here. You've oomed your last bop, Teddy. <laughs> <laughs> Are we there yet? <laughs> now we disabled it. Do you, you have time for a quick donation? Uh, hang on, I gotta sure. point out a guy real quick. As we enter the Celeste zone. Oh yeah, there's Celeste happening. Yeah, he wants a high five, we gotta leave him hanging. Do donations, go. <laughs> oh no. We have an anonymous donation for twenty-one twelve dollars That's right. 2112 Wow. A massive donation, thank wow. you so much. that's good. Yump. Another? Oh, uh, yeah, why not? Sure. I could say words, too. We've got $10 from Iggy Zig. I'm so psyched to see Blasphemous made it into this event. Its stunning visual direction and brutal gameplay are a match made in heaven. Glad to see Teddy having a fun time on stage. Donation goes to all the Katana Zero incentives and shout-outs to Cartridge Blowers, easily my favorite host. Why'd you read that one? I don't know. Oh, I could oh, do this, by the way. Oh. Whoa. It's not that hard to do. Just pause and then, like, hit the R button and unpause. You do it, it's easy. You're supposed to say frame perfect so we can check it off our No, the frame works. perfect thing's coming up. Hang on, I can meme frame perfect later. Okay. And be kind of unironic about it. More of that, because I can. Ooh, okay. <laughs> Two, three. Wee. Wee. Or is that short? Oh my god. Oh no. I'm going to go up the normal, normie way here. Aww. Can you just do it again? I don't want to. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I got to kill this guy. If I get in the wall, I get knocked off. I, didn't count, I, I have the timer here. I could just count with the timer. Why do I have, like, count it out in my head? <laughs> like, I literally have a life split timer to make sure I, like, don't do it too short and I just didn't use it. Nice. I'm gonna kill you. It's oh, this is the Celeste area. There's wind here. I gotta see if I have enough wind to get over here. Cool. A little more floaty. <laughs> Swag. Wee. Wee. Yo. 
down. I think it's the last one of those we see for a hot minute. Those are sweet, though. They're yeah, really they're cool. cool. Just too bad there's not enough vertical for me those to use it too much. Are really sad. About By the way, though, there's going to be a guy here. Statues. Oh, hey. Who is he? I don't know. It's a friend. Oh, he's ready is what he is, apparently. <laughs> Thanks, SpongeBob. Uh, this is a power net. I gotta watch out for her. She'll do half my health just by touching her. She's that swole. Wow. Well, you're swoller. No, <laughs> she is way swoller than I. What? Impossible. More like dark swoles, am I right? Folks. <laughs> hey. <laughs> All right, yeah, coming up, I got a, like, the hard glitch of the run. I gotta do uh, the frame perfect trick. Whoa. Whoa, it, it's, it's speedrunner stuff. Watch out. Boy, that granite toe is doing a lot of work. It's doing work. Kicking its way through lava. <laughs> Hit you. There we go. Gotta uh, wait a lot of me. I could be here a while. Oh, yeah, also, I can't hit her from the bottom. Rude. For no reason, so we gotta wait an extra cycle. Nice. But yeah, I gotta go through that wall by flying upwards, so I need to do it. I gotta climb the ledge at the same time I fly upwards, so Neat. fun stuff. Okay. Ah, beans. This is very dramatic. I like music in this game. It's definitely a really nice aesthetic to it. Yeah, the game looks gorgeous. Definitely. Yeah, it's got like the best pixel art I've ever seen, dude. You literally told me to come in blind, so I, I didn't look Hang up on any. Let me stay on this menu. <laughs> nice. Worst guy's gonna load a save for this, but I like I want to have a not like an actual valid GDQ run, leaderboard valid one for once. All of them have been invalid so far, so. Won't this one be invalid for performance enhancers? <laughs> nah. You're 11 times as strong as you're supposed to be. It's the glitched version. It's legal. Ah. Uh. Going way early. If I go early, I just climb it. If I go late, I bonk my head on the roof, which I don't stick. My head doesn't stick in there for some reason, even though I got a pointy head. Come on. There we go. Hey. Oh, there we go. Easy. Only like 30th try. First try. Let's go. And this lady needs to go to the emergency room or something, but don't worry about it. There's, you got a couple swords, like. <laughs> Please. No? Okay. I'll that's, see you later. That's just her afternoon outfit. Yeah. I'm going out on the town and I... They don't <laughs> let me... They don't, bloody swords everywhere. They don't let me bring my purse to the club, so I have to carry my swords <laughs> like this. <laughs> yeah, this, is, well, this is the big sequence break, too. I'm just gonna... This is an item I get for beating a late game boss. I'm just gonna grab it now, because I can. Mirrored mask of dolphins, I think I read yeah, that Yeah, dolphins. Correctly. Oh, we just fell through. That's cool. Oh, I should pull this in case I fall down there. I'll do that again. Yeah, but yeah, this is probably gonna be a valid run, so hooray. Yay. First valid GDQ run. Yeah. Woo! Back to the Cowabunga Zone. We're gonna thrash some gnar in the Cowabunga Zone? Hell yeah, dude. Ride that curl. They're, they're posing up there. That dude's literally surfing up there. Like, he's not even dead. He's just having a good time. Once again, he's not prepared. He's like, hey, who's been eating? Someone's been eating my nacho cheese. Can you investigate for me? I'm like, yeah, okay. I'll definitely look at it and see if anyone else has nacho cheese in their face. I'm on the case. You know what? I've seen a surprisingly small Case amount closed. Of... Found you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go, what were you saying? Half his face is nacho cheese. The other half is, face. is exposed brain. Sorry, go ahead. No, now I'm transfixed by this extremely good art happening here. I don't even have memes. I like this Bam, game. It's yeah. beautiful. Yeah. She's agreed. just bleeding nacho cheese. What? She ate too much. What oh. the heck? We've all been there. Taco Bell's uh, open 24-7. <laughs> <laughs> We already got you. Get out of here. See right. you later, nerd. And he's here for some reason. No, stop. <laughs> Go away, Tiggle. Would you like to buy a map? Yeah, this is my first love love, technically, I guess. <laughs> Give me the thing. I'm level 12, by the way. I have no context for that. Oh, yeah, the most you can get is seven. I should only have, like, three here. Oh. There's your context. <laughs> 12 out of seven? Yeah, 12 That's out of seven. How improper. That's, like, over one. It's like five or more horses. We're gonna ride this back down. <laughs> if my nose starts to bleed, it's because of Shasta's math. <laughs> yeah, we're not supposed to go this way. I flew through the roof. Remember that? This is the big secret spring. This is like a late game boss. We're gonna go slap him to death. All right, there's another baby. We can't reach him. What ho, sword wizard? Let's go. <laughs> hey, we're gonna go in the scream dungeon now. So for world record attempts, do you skip almost all those save states? <laughs> wow. <laughs> ah. That's what they call it, the Scream Dungeon. 
Just a bunch of screaming. That, now I understand. Cow bug is down in the screen dungeon. <laughs> On your couch, give me your best screams. Ah. 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 Wait, I need more than that. I need more direction than that. What kind of scream? Uh, you're crazy, you're in a dungeon, your hands are tied behind your back, and you just want to scream. Ah, dang. <laughs> That's Heck. a good one. Donators, donate with your favorite screams. <laughs> All right, I got to do a thing here. <laughs> Hopefully a cycle skip. One, two, three. This is the thing I, got, I just purchased. Bam! I don't got time to do a finisher. That's gross. All right, let's see if I can get it. No. Oh. oh. It's really hard. I, like, barely ever get it. We're wasting 20 seconds. What am I doing? Woo! Ah! The triple. Oh, baby. Mom, get the camera. <laughs> oh, yeah. I can go out of bounds if I grab that ledge while climbing this elevator. It pushes me out. It's not fun. I have to reset, or, or I have to, you know, do a quit out and go back to the last bonfire, which means I have to do this entire dungeon over again if I accidentally grab that ledge. So we're going to ride this slightly longer. Yeah, don't, don't do that. Yeah, it'd be dumb. Ah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> ah! It's a fun area. Ah! I almost made an even more dated reference than Hanson when I read. I was about to reference Howard Dean. I'm like, no one knows who that is. I have no idea who that is. Yeah. Is that Jimmy Dean's brother? Yes. You make a good sausage? Mm hmm. Heir to the sausage empire, ran for president, screamed a bunch into a microphone. <laughs> you know. No, I don't. The pot. You know, uh, 2000 and uh, 2004 political references. Very topical. Mm hmm. Ah! Ah! There's more. It's all sounding like to come behind me, too. I'm... Yeah. <laughs> it sounds like the crowd's doing it or something. <laughs> oh, by the way, they can infinite you. Those guys are actually tough. Like, if you don't kill them, they can, like, just hit you and hit you and hit you, and you're just gonna die. That guy really should have worn some armor on something other than his head. Yeah. I mean, like, I'm not ah. tall enough. <laughs> ah. <laughs> <laughs> the screams. Make them stop. <laughs> okay, they're stopped. Okay, oh. one more, then they're stopped. <laughs> We're gonna go fight the boss. He's got anime powers. We don't? Nah. Look at the size of our hair hat. He's yeah. got a hair hat, too. <gasps> You're of equal match. Yeah. You underestimate my power. Do you think he used to be an anime protagonist? Yeah, until he got burned or something. I don't know. I didn't, I didn't press Y to read the lore. That's a thing you do in this game. I haven't done it yet. Press Y to lore anytime you want in the item screen. Oh, he didn't hack me. Somebody just tries to land on my head, and that's really not cool, because... Does a big bunch of damage. Oh, we're doing this. Let her go in the next phase. All right, thank you for letting me hurt you more. Thing he's like already dead. I have to duck for this. It's easy. Hey. I'm just gonna finish him with this. Bam! Sick. Get hacked Ooh. on. Yeah. Dang, you just exploded. Yeah, because there's just a bonfire at the end. We're gonna warp back out. Yeah, it's a perfect fight. Requiem Eternam. <laughs> Spiritus Dominus. Yeah, I'll have uh, <laughs> the mushroom pasta bowl. <laughs> <laughs> you got it, Paisano. But remember the first boss of the game? We're going to fight him in cool silhouette form. Oh, yeah, and yeah, there's two of them. They're getting slapped. Get some. He didn't jump at me, so we got to waste a little more time walking over here. How dare you? I was hoping they, like, I killed them in, like, mid-jump, and it looks super stupid. I was hoping they do that, but unfortunately, bad luck. Those would be, like, dying midair. <laughs> if you got any more questions, that's a good time. I gotta do more walking. I, I Where are you walking to? Yeah, more. Uh, I'm walking to the next glitch. I gotta to also get right. a bonfire. It's a video game. It's true. That's where the, that's where the uh, field goal is. Too. Yeah, that's where we do the down touch. <laughs> the foomt ball. Are we there no. <laughs> <laughs> I can turn the speed run around. <laughs> Good, I didn't die to spikes, that's neat. <laughs> I was about to say you spoke too soon, but... Yeah, it's hard to see that thing, you. like... Geez. Yeah, I gotta go where the glitch is at now. That's just so I can warp back and, like, not walk back, you know? Luckily, this one has a backup, so I'm not gonna be here forever. Hooray. Yay. I can't do a launch here because reasons. I literally don't know why. Just the game's like, no, you can't. Not here. Not this ledge. This ledge is special. What about that ledge with the no, spikes? I will die. Have you tried it? I don't want to. <laughs> mm. Sounds like coward talk. It's just spikes after all. Yeah. The spikes are like the thing everyone has a problem with in this game. 
Yeah, but it's just the devs added a like a like in-game coyote jump to make it like oh what the hell. <laughs> I think you have a problem with spikes too. That wasn't supposed to happen. You're Except supposed to not die. The Thank you. No problem. <laughs> All right, we're gonna have to walk back because that's neat. I was in mid-air. So that happens sometimes. Normally, like you just have like an invisible wall when you get hit, and it'll just like go near the edge and not fall off. Especially if you're mid-air, you just ignore like the knockback. But for sometimes, you just get knocked in the spikes, even though it doesn't normally do that. Because welcome the blasphemous. Oh, so what you're trying to say is that's never. No, don't you dare. <laughs> it's happened many a time. Mm -hmm. You're about to curse my run, Denny. <laughs> We're gonna have some that's never happened before soon, and I don't like that. I'm gonna, I'm afraid now. I, they, they've hurt me once. There, there's my souls, by the way. Or not even, it's just like I get health oh. up. We did it, we got past spikes. Now we gotta do another launch. It's not hard. Why are you clapping? I'm gonna wait for this. <laughs> that means clap more. <laughs> don't you clap. <laughs> Stop it. Take that, runner. I was gonna count to 11 on this one. There we go. Nope. We're doing seven second ones, because these are shorter. I can skip the whole thing, but like, I have to pause longer, so that's, I, when I start, I forgot how to count, cool. <laughs> nice, my thumb did that, how dare you? Are we there yet? Thanks, thumb. <sighs> if only it were made of threat, granted. Nope, I hit that early. Isn't that a frame perfect trick? Yeah, I gotta go through some walls. Oh, okay. Do another launch. Do the thing. Come on. Are you looking for a certain amount of speed to break through there? Yeah, I need the, the longer I pause, the more speed I get. Then it's just timing. Come on. I can go around too. It's just this is normally faster if I don't mess up. And this is cooler. Anyway. What are you doing, Thumb? How dare you? I'm hitting like left and right of this, or left and down at the same time. You know, wait a sec. Let's get to listen to these tasty jams over here. This, this is, is a Spanish yeah. guitar. This game was like made in Spain. Let's go. I'm going early. Was it truthfully? Is that where the dev team is? Yeah. Oh, cool. It's hard to tell with you sometimes. <laughs> what am I doing? I'm gonna get one more try after this one, then I'm just gonna go around. Oh my god, I keep going too early. Yeah, this is the last try, and then I'm just gonna go around. I believe. Frame perfect. Nah, we're going around. Ah, keep doing uh, it too early. Yeah, back here, I need to go grab the mask, then we're just gonna go put it in the elevator like we need to later. Oh, what are you doing? I got hecked. <laughs> oh, you've been sent to the heck zone. I've been sent to the Shadow Realm, which is just down here. It's not too bad. You can climb out of it. That's good. Two, three. Yeah, oh, what are you doing? I guess I did that wrong. Whoops. <laughs> bonk. <laughs> I get to skip that whole bonk area, which I'm thankful for. It was Two, just... three. Whee. Whee. I swore I can do launches. <laughs> That was a really satisfying bonk noise. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm grabbing the mask. Out of here. Uh, that's, you, you could dupe those. Oh, hang on, he heals for safety. You could dupe those masks. That's what they do in 90%, but I don't need to for this. I just need to get up to a certain level in the elevator. Yeah, I'm just unlocking a teleporter is what I want to do with this. But to get there, I'd have to like, either beat the entire game or just do this. Don't beat the entire game. It's gonna take too long. I gotta beat the entire game first. What am I doing? You just charge him. And, eh. Can you pet that dog? That is not a dog. That is the monster from Spirited Away. What are you doing? You can feed him some everything if you want. <laughs> oh, what? No, that's already down here. We don't have to do anything. There we go. That'll give him masks for their faces. They're apparently giant masks, but don't worry about the logistics on that. It works. That was the least of my questions. <laughs> okay, what is the first of your questions? Are we there yet? No. One more.
Okay, we're there. Yay! Yay. <laughs> <laughs> this place sucks. Yeah, I gotta go back over here and get the teleporter. Stupid frame perfect tricks, what the heck? We'll come back here through later when I go to the final boss, but yeah. I'm supposed to end up up here, but whatever. We did it once, that's all that matters. Yay. Now, this shrine was here in the beginning of the game, but I skipped it because the other shrine is working through the dupes easier. For some reason, I can't use the controller to level up. I have to, like, press the K on the keyboard. Doesn't make sense, whatever. Old patch, they fixed it. Don't worry about it. They're on that. They're ready. They got it. They handle it. Good game. Yeah, imagine being a dev and you watch the game get displayed and you're like, oh, this is a like patch. what do you fix that? <laughs> now, they already handled it. Like, they just watch it. Like, yeah, we, we took care of it. Easy. I paused wrong. You gotta do it again? Yeah, I gotta get. That's where the boss is. True. We, I'm up here. Oh, by the way, if I hold right too much when I do in these launches and go off screen, I'll have to, I'll just be out of bounds and stuck. I can grab that mask a second time. That's how you dupe it, but I don't need to. We're gonna get the Jim Carrey mask later. Smoking. He got hands. We're in the bone zone. We gotta get him out of here. No. Oh. <coughs> Uppercut. Get you with the 2H. Oh, this thing just yeets me. Oh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> oh, my God, I'm getting hecked up. Oh, dude, I actually might die here. Don't do that. It's 90. Oh, get him. There we go. Cool. Ooh. Nice. <laughs> I was like, I'm not going to show this, but I'm going to get yeeted by this. And then I, it happens right when I see it. <laughs> yeah. Requiemated them. Let's do a quit out. But yeah, we're, we're past all the glitches now, pretty much. No. Oops. Oh, what am I doing? I need a heal. It doesn't heal me. It's not a homeward bone. This ain't Dark Souls. No free heals. You gotta do it yourself. But yeah, unfortunately, the next area is the hardest area. So, oh, wait. No sensor box. Cool. All right, we got a minute for donations. Go for it. Reading, like, two or three. Sure thing. We've got a $50 anonymous donation that says, just finished a casual playthrough of Blasphemous. So I had to donate during this run. $100 from Yinj. Can we make a donation train happen to reach the Katana Zero extra boss incentive? It's an awesome boss that we shouldn't miss out. Also, honk. We're uh, still a little under $3,000 away from the psychotherapy incentive and a little under 6,000 away from the upgrade to hard mode. And you Let only you. have until the end of this run. All right, so this is the library. It sucks. These librarians are mean, too. They're like, hey, here's some knowledge. I'm like, no, I want to be ignorant. <laughs> and also, a bunch of these Shakespeare heads. This is like the big Castlevania area. It feels like these are the Medusa heads, basically. Oh, jeez. They're not as bad as Medusa heads, though. I fell off the thing. Nice. Look at that. Not optimized. How dare me. <laughs> it's OK. You're doing your best. Here's the only bonfire to you now in the next one. It's going to be bad. This NPC is cool, but he doesn't do anything. He gives you some souls if you like talk to a body or something. Take this brochure Maybe he does. the Scholastic Book <laughs> Fair back home. <laughs> Do you need a locksmith? I'm open 24 hours. Outrun the book? Did you actually outrun the book till it disintegrated? I, I don't know. I was paying attention. <laughs> Get out of here. No, no, tell me that knowledge. I hit you with my sword. Jeepers. Oh, God. Don't touch me. Yeah, this is the room that can hack me big time. It's ghosts and book fellas. Are uh, the ghosts? Oh, God. Their height is random. Where they are in the left to right is fixed. Every time I go in here, come on. Okay, that's all the ghosts. Don't touch them. Cool, we're out of here. Cool. One more hex zone. I'm gonna, oh, no, there's this room. I forgot this exists. Light shield, cool. Is it also a hex zone? It's also a hex zone. Oh, no. They're all hex zones. The library sucks. This is, the, like, the place where I'll die. Support your purple libraries, folks. Let's go library. Oh, nice ladder. Ladders are stupidly precise. I don't know why. Pixel perfect laddering. Heh. <laughs> Get him. Just parry that book. It's from the Donkey Kong Arcade School of Ladders. Get out of here. I love doing that. You can slap the books. Despite the book going, like, way behind him, he still caught it. These guys are baller as heck. Oh, well, nice. He got me. <laughs> Just I'm about to die. I'm, why am I on this ladder? Who did that? Who made me climb that ladder? He's so grabby. Why does he do this? All right, last part where I can get hacked. I need to jump this book twice, and then we're out of here. Cool. Whee! Yay. Gotta Yay. get this triple enemy. It's a man holding a moose with a lady running in here. Here's our friend again. She has a cool hat, but you didn't notice it because she's got all these swords sticking at her. Like, maybe 
Should I call you an Uber for like the hospital or something? No, she can teleport. All right, get that checked out. <laughs> yeah, that's the hard part of this place. We're done with it. Yay. We get re a reward for beating this hard area is a second hard area with pendulums, which is gonna be real fun. As long as it's not full of anything scary like books. Yeah, no, we're done with books. Books terrify me. <laughs> Take that. Yeah, this one's all paintings. Another super Castlevania E area. These paintings look like they're flipping me off, too. I don't know why. Rude. Slabity, 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 slap. Get out of here. Don't slide. Okay, good. I can fall off that, and it's really annoying. It's not death, but it's just time waste. Here's our friend, the pendulums. Get out of here. You're rude. With spikes. They're, they're always combined with spikes, because they just don't like me. What am I? Charge. There we go. That was good attack speed there. You were using something to cancel the attacks? Yeah, that's what I'm doing the whole time. I, thought I, I, I think I mentioned that earlier. But yeah, I just hit duck to cancel attacks, and that makes me attack faster. Mm -hmm. All right, our next boss is called Exposito, which I think means exposed, but I always call him Despacito because it yep. sounds the same. And plus, I want him to go slower because he's always just speeding around going slow side. That's not the boss, by the way. That's just a big baby. This is the boss over here. I haven't played Death Stranding, but I assume this is how it ends. Yeah, he just, the baby just gets too much power. Yeah, he's got two hitboxes and one hit both at once. I think this baby's an instant kill. I've never been hit by him. Let's not do it now. It's never happened before. It's never happening ever. Go. <laughs> go, 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 go. Okay, we're good. Double hits, please. He does a ton of damage, so I want to kill him ASAP. There we go. Get out of here. Also, this boss gets salty. Sometimes he can kill me after the fight's over, which, no, don't. That's not cool. Real rude. What are you doing, baby? Baby, you're done. Get out of here. It's the dancing baby gif. <laughs> Except, wait, why is he still here? Go away! <laughs> We're done with you. <laughs> oh, has that not occurred in the past? It's random. Like, sometimes he disappears, sometimes he sticks around. Sometimes, like, he's like, let me just do a tail attack on you when the fight's over and murder you. I think the first time I beat him, I got killed after I beat the boss. <laughs> I was like, yeah, thanks. What a salty boss. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna get my last upgrades here. We're strong. We got double the normal levels here. We're at 14, if I did it right. Phew. Second son of Big McLarge Huge. Sword McFlex Squat. <laughs> Beef Hard Cheese. Biff Squat Thrust. <laughs> hey, we're quitting out. Punch Stone Girl. Yeah, there, there's that Jim Carrey mask. We don't want to put it on where you have to do a, like, a third son of the mask movie. He... Yeah, no. Soft pass. I'm not sure how many they made, but like, I don't want to know. Hopefully just the Stop one. it. Hopefully, yeah. I have a way to slide past those guys that are taking damage, and like, I'm the only one who does it too, but I just decided not to do it there because my brain's dumb. Thanks. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, God, I'm gonna get hacked a little. Whatever. He gets one shot now. We're so buff. Yeah, you like pendulums? Here's the ultimate pendulum room. Fun times ahead. Uh, if they hit me, I get just knocked the heck away, which, yeah, there's nothing to land on, so I, it's I spikes. Don't, I don't, I wouldn't say I like pendulums. I don't like them either. I got through the pendulum room like nothing. Get out of here, pendulums. Get hecked on. <laughs> Woo! I'm just saying, I really go back and forth on them. Okay, so we're going to the first boss. Oh, oh my god, are you serious with that joke? <laughs> 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 Took a second. I was like, did he just. On my couch? <laughs> <laughs> did he just defy. Yeah, you need to seek penance, sir. <laughs> on this? The day of my. <laughs> yeah, we, we're waking up the first boss. He's very grumpy. Jeez, calm down. What okay, the heck, fine. dude? Is that guy Groot? No. I missed, whatever, it's fine. I got bonked. Ten Pi Dad? That's this guy's name? Oh, yeah, Ten Pi Dad. I think it means forgive me or something. You're not forgiven, you're dead. See you. Layer nerd. Requiem eternam. Oh. Oh. One last time to the cowbunga zone. <laughs> Gnarly. Tubular. Cowabunga Just like, requiem. Look at that guy. He's enjoying himself up there. By the way, the mouse gets captured in this game on the old patch. They fixed that too. The devs are great. But yeah, like, there, there, there's so many runs where like I would just have like the mouse like here the entire time and not notice it because like my mic's like right there. Oh yeah, we don't want to hear him talk. We're not mashing any for. 
I thought I was doing that wrong hand. Nice job, always, This is stuff you, you should always be pressing buttons. It's stuff yeah. Neutron, get out of here. <laughs> Dude, we're gonna skip this real Dark Souls-ass cutscene here. It's like, I don't know, straight out of Dark Souls pretty much. You just like a big door open and all that whenever. Buy the game if you want to watch it. Too bad, this is a speed and we ain't got time for that. Yeah, the first bosses for some reason act like a bonfire, so if I do a quit out, I'm just like, I spawn where they were. It's weird, yeah, now I'm gonna take this bonfire. I need to warp here later. There's a teleporter down here I need to come back to. And healed. Healed, easy peasy. Yeah, this is a fun area. It's one of those areas where like, there's only one checkpoint and going further in the area unlocks, oh, I went the wrong way, unlocks the uh, ways to get back to that checkpoint, which I'm a big fan of that in game design. Love those areas, they're fun. But since we're going through it backwards, just we pretty much skip the entire area. We just unlock the gates, then just move past them. You see what you did, audience? He actually turned the speed run around. <laughs> yeah, you know what you did? I, okay, we just warped, whatever. You're really playing with fire, complaining about if we're there yet or not this close to Disney World. Those words have extreme power in this part of the country. I can't hear you. Oh, we had to stop. <laughs> Dang. Don't make me come back there. <laughs> Need a fly swatter or something. Quiet, you. <laughs> we'll get McDonald's later. <laughs> no, figure it out with your sister. <laughs> it can't be both Wendy's and McDonald's. <laughs> All right, yeah, we're gonna fight the like first major boss in the game, I guess. We're supposed to be. Diglet, dig, diglet, dig. Trio, trio, <laughs> trio. Diglet, dig, trio, trio, trio. <laughs> this is a great couch. I'm liking it. <laughs> Make good choices. <laughs> but yeah, this is Ezra. This is the guy from earlier. Now we know who he is, kinda. He's, he said he was ready. He's ready. His body is ready. Yo, why am I sliding? Whatever. He's gonna try to heck me. This spins. Beyblade, let her rip. Bam. Yeah, he can actually kill me. He's tough. Yeah, oh, he's geez. ready. Stop. He's so ready. Spy is ready. But are you? I need to dodge this, or Ooh. we're gonna have to dodge this, actually. Cool. He's dead, though. I want to get a glitch where I kill him before that happens, because he'll just, like, keep attacking me and kill me, which will actually be faster to die here, man. Whatever. He's tough, but we got him. <laughs> Thank you. Somebody got it. <laughs> I didn't want to say I was, I was waiting for you to say it. I was waiting for you. What? <laughs> say it all the time. Can't do it all the time. But you can, you're the right. I'll, I'll do it the next time, fine. Okay, thank you. <laughs> I'm gonna sing the praises to the miracle, which I guess is like the plot of this game. It makes everyone immortal or something. Uh, that's the thing I locked earlier. We're just gonna go straight to the end of the game now. Hooray, we beat all the bosses except for two, so we need to do all, I need to not slide. We did, we did, I didn't die, cool. Yeah. I always slide off that edge, it's really dumb. There's no, pl there's no platform to slide there, you just die. I don't need this bonfire. It's not even that, f yeah, it's great. Nice, I'm gonna die to Crescenta now, he jinxed it. No slide here. Oh, it's right here, I forgot we did the dumb I suck at this game way. Instead of the flying to the roof a second time. Darn frame perfect tricks. Can only do it once, whatever. It sucks, I was gonna get like first second trial this week, I'm like, dang, I don't need to practice, I'm good at this game, we're gonna nail it during GDQ, and then <laughs> like 12th try. And other cursed things people have dang. said in the practice You mean room. first try. Uh, 12th try. This person's hat is even taller than yours. I mean, he's got like the ball on top, though. She looks like a clown. Looks like freaking Poplio or something. Don't you do that. No energy. What do you, you missed? What do you do? All right. Oof. Okay, I'm just going to parry her all day. I want her to parry me a bunch. Oh, God. Oh, that was Ooh. bad timing. Yeah, she goes uh, Super Saiyan. Okay. And now she's either going to attack me or, which I want her to do, or she's going to go back and do Super Saiyan moves. Which I just wanted to keep parrying, come on. Bad luck. Yeah, Super Saiyan seems like it takes a while. Like an episode or a half of charging. At least. We ain't got time for that. We're speed running. It's all locked though, so. How dare you? We're going fast, lady. You're, I know you're going fast for me, technically, but like, relax yourself. Oh, wait, no, no, hang. I can't kill her during this. I have to wait for her to do this. Because, yeah, we got something coming up here. If I kill her during that, she disappears, but if I kill her now... There we go. All right, say, she did back to that, but she died. What a show-off. All right, <laughs> save or cool. kill? Uh, uh, kill! Good, we're gonna kill her. No hats may stand above ours. Your hat's dumb. 
No, get your baited. She's in the DLC. No. Uh, you fools. You ignoramuses. You absolute buffoons. <laughs> you told me to come in blind. It was a trick. <laughs> Yeah, here's that lady. You should give me an item or something. She's alive. Hooray, we saved her. Yay. We just did this to sell more speed runs. <laughs> <laughs> he just want people to lean boards, you monster. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna play the game, come on. Yeah, now we're gonna kill the Pope. Wow. That's just how it works sometimes. Sometimes you're just fighting the hack guy, sometimes you kill the Pope. It's that would be. <laughs> Big Sinead O'Connor energy. <laughs> To get the glitch. No, he's gonna attack me, Dink. Sometimes he just like sits there and lets me hurt him and destroy him, but yeah. This time, nah. He did, even the easiest attack, at least, that's nice. Oh my god, I remember this. I went on a trip Stop to Rome it. and he shot poison balls at our tour group. I know, that was crazy, right? There he goes, the Pope is dead. Crab emojis. <laughs> <laughs> but unfortunately, this is the two Popes. That's just, that was just, uh, what's his face? Anthony Hopkins. Uh, now can't... we have Dwayne the Pope Johnson we gotta deal with. I can't keep up with this. There was a young Pope, there's a new Pope. I know, there's too many Popes. Red Popes, blue Popes. This is a red Pope, by the way. Okay. I gotta wait, uh, let's just heal, might as well. This boss does hella damage. That's I gotta wait pope. anywhere for the platforms to spawn. This is a giant mecha Pope. Oh, why'd you give me this attack? That's great. Random, they all suck. This one sucks the most, I think. Or no, well, fireballs are bad, but those show up later. They're not anything right now. There really is trouble with the Pope Johnson. They're king. Is this our He's last huge. boss? He's huge. He works out. Teddy, is this our last boss? Oh, this is our last boss, yeah. We got him, cool. Before he got into the BS happening, yeah. So, like, yeah, when I buffed 11, I used, I think when I submitted the game, I buffed to 7, and this guy was actually a big worry because we'd be on here much longer. But when I buffed to 11 damage, he goes down pretty, pretty quick, which is nice. His fireballs do much. Okay, sing it with me. Summa blasphemia. It's different uh -huh. this time. You got fooled. Yeah. A second time. I got bamboozled. Joke's on you. I'm vaccinated for Summa Blasphemia. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> yeah, we got some cutscenes and the run's gonna end. Remember, folks, vaccinations like that are part of preventing cancer. <laughs> Hooray. You gotta jump up Ash Mound real quick. Bye, Tingle. See ya. Is I'll miss you. Or no, we're gonna see him later. Hang on, he's in the cutscene. Whoa. Is Tingle Pope now? Is Tingle no, Pope? No, he doesn't become Pope. I become... I, actually, who, no one's Pope now, I think. I don't even know. Well, don't ask, I don't know the lore. Press Y to lore. You'll figure it out on your own. <laughs> And time. <laughs> There's my mouse. It's there. <laughs> I guess this is part we do like shout outs or whatnot. So uh, shout outs to at Mr. Shasta. Shout outs to at Macadani. Shout outs to like everyone from chat and everything. I heard Levi donated during the run, so shout out to him specifically, I guess. Shout out to indie games, specifically one like this game, uh, Fight Crab. Uh, there's one called Ultra Kill that's coming out soon, it's pretty cool. And uh, My Summer Car, which I mentioned during the interview, that one's awesome. And uh, yeah. Shout out to GQ as well for accepting this on the second yeah. round submission. Second round submission, that was pretty cool too. I, yeah. didn't expect, I didn't expect it to get in at all, especially on Saturday. I was like, I can only go for like a day. <laughs> and like, yeah, it's cool. Can... Okay, appreciate art time. Appreciate the art. Okay, it's over. No more appreciation. There was, this is a good pixel art in this game, yeah. Nah. <laughs> are there any more books? <laughs> no, books are done. But as a tradition, we're going to delete our save file immediately. We don't need that. Books are Get canceled, out of here. folks. We're done with this run. We're out of here. Get me out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get one more round of applause for that amazing run of Blasphemous from Teddy Rass. We got a $250 donation from Ethan Fire. Played the Blasphemous demo, and it was great. So, here's to Katana Zero. Awesome Games Done Quick 2020 is brought to you by World 9 Gaming. Are you looking to up the game at your convention? From eSports to PCs and consoles, old and new, World 9 Gaming aims to provide the best video gaming experience to events in the Midwest 
and beyond. Proud equipment partner of Games Done Quick for over five years, World 9 is ready to take your event to the next level. For booking, check us out on Facebook, Twitter, or email world9gaming at gmail.com. We've got $100 from Tian Shinhan, who says, Requiem $5 from Suraya. Admittedly, I knew nothing about this game going into the run, and I'm thoroughly enjoying it, especially everyone's incredible commentary. Thanks for making this super fun to watch. Shout out to CB for rounding out this awesome block. Thank you. $50 from Kimmy Cat. Cancer took both of my partner's grandparents, my grandfather, and my aunt is currently fighting and winning her third battle against it. A massive shout out and thank you to the GDQ staff and everyone who's donated to help put an end to this disease. Another shout out to Soraya, Iggy Zig, and Cartridge Blowers for being such awesome hosts. Loads of love from Kimmy and Jerry. Aww. That's going to be it for me today, but I'm going to send it on over to Kizaron and Caveman to tell you about some of the amazing prizes that you can win. Take it away. Hi, everyone. It's Kizaron here, and I'm here with the mustacheless caveman, DCJ. Hey, how's it going, gang? Um, yeah, I'm here again somehow, <laughs> once again by virtue of being awake. Uh, and we're here to talk to you about... What are we here to talk to you about? Well, I mean, I figure everyone at home might want to know what you actually do behind the scenes, and then we'll also talk about some prizes, because that always goes well with me. So what, what do you do behind the scenes? <laughs> <laughs> well, like, the behind the scenes of G... Are you asking me, like, what my, what my literal job is, or what do I do at the event? <laughs> sure, let's go with both. Dude, I work in radio sales, man. I don't know what I do. All right, well, uh, radio from radio. Okay, yeah. how, about, how about GDQ? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah I'm, I'm yeah, an interview yeah. producer. I am one of the uh, fine people working behind the scenes. Everyone's wondering, where's Caveman? Where's his... 4 a.m. runs, the prime time Zelda, as this marathon showed. But um, so what I do is uh, is this. I like I go, hey, this is this is a camera. Get in on my eyeballs. Yeah. Nope. I see. I see a camera. Up. He he thought about it. He ran to it. And double taped. <laughs> don't don't spoil the magic. Don't spoil the magic. Hey, you asked me what I do. This well, okay. is What I do. Uh, well you gotta, you gotta live, leave a little... I, make the, I am just an aspiring cog in the machine. I make the marathon work for all of you beautiful boys and girls watching at home. And I understand you represent the PlayStation Nation behind the scenes as well. What gave you that idea? I... I... I, I don't know, maybe your shirt? Yeah, yeah, it's a good shirt. Anyway, yeah, um, I, I do represent the PlayStation Nation, the hottest speed click in all of speed gaming. Um, I also host... Two of the baddest tournaments at GDQs. If you ever come to these events live, you can sign up for Evil Zone, the hottest two-button fighting game on the PS1. And you can also sign up for the PS1 Mystery Versus Tournament, a tournament that I'm currently the grand champion of, so, you know, come Sir at me. Sir humble brag. So how long have you actually been running those tournaments? Because that's something that like, a lot of people at home might not actually be aware of. So obviously there's stuff that happens here at the event besides just the event itself. We have stuff like an arcade that's sponsored by Tokyo Attack. We have a big room with a bunch of TVs, a bunch of games, a bunch of us nerding out and stuff. And as you mentioned, we have tournaments running and whatnot. So Evil Zone and the Mystery Tournament. How long have you been running those? All right, let me give you, let me tell you the tale of Evil Zone. Oh boy. It all started in the halcyon age of speedrunning. <laughs> AGDQ 2015. At that event, there was a game, st a game store. We can talk. Close by uh, called East Starland. And at this game store, we found a game called Evil Zone. And we played it, and we were like, this game is hilarious. And I understand that Mike Uyama is a connoisseur. Mike of Uyama of is, one of, is one of the four gods of Evil Zone. <laughs> With myself, Dragon Blitz, and Punchy. 
All right, we'll, we'll just we'll move on to some prizes. How about that? Oh, yeah, prizes. Very good, very good. So I'm going to try my best scent yet again. Maybe I'll even uh, hold stuff incorrectly. I was told how to hold this. Nope, nope, nope. keep going. Yep, there we go. Will, will it... Nope, nope, the top? nope. You know Ro what? Rotate it 90 degrees. This, there it is. This is how I'm holding yeah, it. Yeah, it's Flagra, man. This is, here you go. You get to hold it. Dude, then. I love this guy. Where's Guybon? Hey, look at Oh, you mean this? Yo! Oh, my goodness. So we're both like them, brothers, man. Both of them are $25 donations each. Uh, these were provided by The Chain Nerd. And this is open until the end of Clone Hero. It's very weighty, obviously, because it's, it's, it's chained. Chain. It's expected it to be weighty. I'm going to, like... Put that gently on my lap. Ooh, it's here. like a little lap. It's like a it's weighted really blanket. Really cold. <laughs> it, <laughs> we also have this uh, Destiny Chill Kingdom Hearts card. Uh, this is a ten dollar minimum donation, and it was provided by Shuggle Up Sketches. And once again, until the end of Clone Hero. Look how, how pretty that is. It's actually really well done. I, I'm just gonna. Who's that? Is that, is that, is that, is that and, Donald? Oh, hey, don't don't show the camera when Look, I do Donald that. That's Duck, horrible. Man. We also have this beautiful Metroid Perler scene, and this is a 15 minimum donation from Pearl Pop. Uh, once again, Clone Hero, that seems to be their current theme with everything I'm talking about right now. You can uh, send, put this in front of my face before and you can still see my face, so that's really unfortunate for those at home. I'm gonna make you hold that. Oh, you're gonna make me hold, what about Absolutely. the next one? Oh, well, you know what? You're gonna make me hold Samus? You can have Caveman as a prize. Oh, nobody cares about K uh, the, the one fan that you wow. have. Hey, I'm washed up. <laughs> $15 minimum donation. This was provided by Wolf and Wings. Um, this is Bonk the Caveman, and I, I guess I'll give the Cavekin to you. I Thank will you. trade you for the Perler. He's my little buddy. Because this is very much not PlayStation, and it seems really weird by your side. We also have, glowing in front of us, the Yeti Custom GDQ PC. Provided by, of course, the Yeti. $100 minimum donation, and you can get, do that all the way until the end of the marathon. And then we also have our grand prize, which is a heroic replica, custom replica. We've seen them before. We have, like, the Hylian Sword and Shield combo. Uh, there are some restrictions that apply to that, but you can get basically anything from any video game that you want to try to get. That's a $200 cumulative throughout the marathon, and that just that closes soon, I believe, like after this. So if, if, you, if you rush your money real quick, you could possibly get a shield or a giant caveman. One of the two. Am I a prize? <laughs> you're, you're, I am a prize. You're yeah, a don't prize lie to now. me. I do have one more question for you, though, before we throw it back up. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Do you want to play DDR? Absolutely. All right, we're going to go play DDR. Uh, hope you guys enjoy Katana Zero. Bye-bye. And thank you so much to Kizarine and Caveman for that awesome prize exhibition. My name is Sakura Tsubasa, and I will be here as your host for the next run here, about 30 minutes. So it's a short one, but a good one. So coming up next, we have Katana Zero run by Yisk. We do have a few incentives that do need to be met for that. We are $440 away from the psychotherapy incentive. So just a little bit more of a push and we will get there. We will be right back after this quick Twitch ad.
Welcome back, everyone, to Awesome Games Done Quick 2020. We have a $25 donation from Kedistra that says, Blasphemous is such an awesome game, and Katana Zero deserves to be shown in all its awesomeness, too. So excited for this block. Also, pet that cat. And with that, look.